Mm -hmm. Something wrong? Hey! I love you! <laughs> oh no! What the hell? <laughs> I love you! I love you! I love you! Oh shit! Here we go again. This is, this is, this is the first dream event of the 21st century. If you choose the wrong groove, you may just lose. Are you ready to get, get it on? Yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah. Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me, a tall girl, for tonight's uh, a tall gamer for Wednesday, February twenty. Is it twenty second? Um, February twenty second, twenty twenty three. I'm going to be continuing my gameplay of like a dragon Ishin. Yeah. Yeah, where I left off. So, I day is um, I had um, I took I escaped the uh, my little like some village of Tosa and uh, that I just been framed for murder of my master. But now I'm I have um escaped and now I'm hiding out and under a different identity to um, try to clear my name. So that's what's going on. And so far, all I was doing is just like exploring the the new area. The, and I get sense of what's going on. What the? Uh, okay. I think that's better. Okay, okay so. Get to it. Um, continue. Oh, and uh, let's do, And uh, I was able to um, <laughs> get, you know, claim my um, DLC pack that I got from my um, pre orders. From pre ordering the game, like, like several months ago. Like, I had to find this, uh, uh the clown bob right here. So it turns out he was hiding inside the, the hotel where I, where I've been staying. So, so I, where I cleaned all my, um, DLC stuff, so you can see. Hey, I'm back to Matsu, Bob. Utsu, Utsu no Mia. <laughs> Let's see if I got anything to give you. These are all the type of tea. There's just one that I was, I think, just one I wasn't able to get. But. So now, don't worry, there's no string attached. Okay, so I can go here. If I go and switch the... This was my, what I have right now. Get it? Kijemaru Kushi Shige. I don't have any ears. What do you This black chip cannon. Hmm, that's a chip. Oh, I need this. I guess I need to heal for it. These are all the. So, I just have to keep going around and, you know, doing all these adventures and collecting oh. the kill orbs and oh. So this game is, you know, is a for the first time, it's you know, it's not running on the the Sega's own like um, graphic engine, the Dragon engine, but if they're easily run on it. But this one is like run on a Unreal engine, which is like the universal game engine, like used by like, most all like game companies. But they, uh, I don't think I really. It seems like all that very impressive at, at all. I think, I think the graphic, the quality right the, the dragon is still more superior. Over here, the graphic doesn't seem very um, crisp and polished. I mean, you can tell some of the, like, um, some areas it looks like pretty blurry. Like, not very, like, uh, well defined. 
That's just me. <laughs> I don't know who anyone else. Everyone has their own like different preferences. Okay. Well, what are you doing just standing there? Apologize. <laughs> yeah, see? You guys show you why I do this? I'll call the Shinsen Gumi. What? You, Pia. Say that again. Hey, apologize and give us some coin to make this right. Unfortunately, I have neither money nor enough policy with scum like you. Hey, shoot for the planes. Idea for the faster. Get up and attention! Oh, uh, Romy, you want attention? I'll show you my thing. Wow, I switched up my um <laughs> weapon is like really a lot does a lot more damage. <laughs> Alright, that's enough! We're sorry, okay? Forgive us! Run along now, you pussies. Thank you, sir. We've had to deal with so many women like that lately. You're a lifesaver. Obtain one real. Ooh. I still don't know how much one real is in the, in the old Edo period. I haven't got a chance to. Yeah. Let's see if I can. Welcome, what can I do for you? Oh. I tell you that's why in the store. But they charge it up here and we store it. I don't know. I do need to actually I need to sell out those gold plates. Huh? You sure? Come back again. I'm just still like exploring like getting around the town. I'll try it in here. The room I eat. Yes I think anything you like. Do you like anything to eat? I'll just have a... Oh. I'll just have a... What was that sake? What was the cheapest? Oh, potato sake. Potato sake. Made by adding grated yam to sake. It's said to be nourishing, it's very cheap, beneficial to the soul. That'd be 2015 minutes. What would you like to eat? We have many delicious dishes. I guess I'll have a... You know, the cheapest thing there. I had pickled eggs in it. I'll be nourishing. Oh, yeah. It's good. It's good. Well, for chicken. It's okay. okay. Thank you so much. Please don't come back to me. Thank you. And let me go find them. Um, that one. Yeah. Find the fun shop. Hey, see them? Aren't they? Shinsengumi. Shinsengumi. Dude, let's finish. This? This? Oh, what did you see? Sakamoto? Yeah, he has like a what? Unibrow! <laughs> My gum! It is you! Well, I'll be! It's me, Shimada! Thanks for meeting you all the way here in Kyo! You've got the wrong guy. He's supposed to be undercover. Yeah. Don't blow my cover! This party rep any day! Over your voice. Oh, oh no! It's the Shitengumi! Bye! Bye! I gotta go! They're on the way! After them! Not, not me, uh. Oh. Wait, uh, I guess I have to. Hi. Chase battle against the Shinsengumi troopers. 
Run away from your pursuers. When you're being chased, the screen will turn red. Pick the pursuers up by either hiding or putting enough distance between them and yourself. Then continue to your objective. On the map, you'll find buckets, pelicans, and wooden boards propped against buildings. Oh, this isn't where I can hide, huh? <laughs> Approach these spots and hide by pressing B. This will shake your pursuit file quickly, but you can't hide if they're already bearing you down on you. They will chase you as soon as they see you, so do what you can to avoid their line of sight. Oh boy, that's like a chase mission. Is there anywhere I can hide? Uh, hey, go over here. <laughs> In the bucket! Hmm. Of I've lost him. Good thing. Okay. I was actually on my way to the episode concert. Oh. I'm gonna hide this one. Hi. My turn. Bye bye. Okay. I guess I do. I cannot help. Going well? Alright. <laughs> 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 I guess I can't really, really do anything. I do have to, I have to go to that big spot. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, So close. Ah! Darn it! <laughs> Ran right into it. Hey! Get off me! It's a good place to hide. Success! Heard there was a big show down nearby. <laughs> well, I guess I'm gonna be. This is gonna be one of the. <laughs> one of the um, um, objectives I'm gonna do, um, deal with. Oh, out there. Oh, there's that dude. <laughs> Supposed to be your uh, Akiyama. Yeah, I haven't met him yet. I haven't played the uh, other uh, Yakuza games, but I know who he is. Who are you? Oh, well, now, <laughs> Can we not do that? <laughs> who am I, you ask? <laughs> the fellow guy in the run. Let's see. Goodbye, then. 
Hey, pal. Did you find that Tenen Rishin swordsman you're looking for? Oh yeah, he was there at that dojo earlier. He was eavesdropping. What was that? <laughs> All right. Who are you? You don't remember? I was at the dojo earlier. So, I guess I didn't exactly understand what you said. Hehehe, they could call careless man. Yeah. Yeah, you can call it eavesdropping. I call it here for good gossip. One of my many talents. That still doesn't tell me who you are. Ah, I'm the boy in Matsusuke of the Choshu. I'm not looking for you. I'm actually a loyal shishi. It's the Bafuku and Shisekumi spawning with my head on their platter. You see? So then, is Niboro just an ally? <laughs> well, forgive me for not answering your question, my stranger. But were you to join me, I'll gladly tell you my real name. At least in this place. What? Nani? <laughs> you see, I've been scoping out local dojo looking for a man of skill. What are you recruiting for? Oh, I've been thinking about causing what you might call a disruption. And due to the nature of the job, I only want the best of my team. You seem like you're perfect. So, I'm not interested in you or your job. Go find someone. You're fun. You're fine. I get it. Why don't I restart our conversation with a favor? Huh? That talent I spoke of is known for our wine in Choshu. I'm one of the best performance players. Okay. And why are you telling me this? You're helping make the actual progress. Using a media for informants. What only thing is media for information. Well, I suppose that's all you can afford. But anyway, that guy people call the crow, he's the most media for informants. And what are you saying I should do? If you really want to find your talent in the future, I can introduce you to the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. I'll show you the best information broker in the future. <laughs> the Purgotera comes up here too. It goes by the Bathkeeper of Sai. <laughs> bathkeeper? It's because he meets his clients at a bath. He keeps it up every time. I see. Anyway, I'll ask him before I make a friend look at the Tenen Rishin 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 Then, once the sun's gone down, make your way to the bathhouse in South Yashikimachi. Tell them you're before in Matsusuke. Just set you up with my guests. You're all proceeding a bit too generous. The catch. Aren't we suspicious? You don't have to trust me if you don't want to. But even if I did have something up my sleeve, you'd still get more out of cooperating than not. Just tell me this. If I go to the bathhouse in South Yashikimachi and say I'm Nibori Matsusuke, only then I can meet this informant? Indeed. And there's a time yet before nightfall. So be wary of the Shinsengumi. I probably don't have to tell you that. Ever since the Bakugou put them in charge of peacekeeping, Ronin like you have anything to do with peace. Make one wrong move, and you're dead. Sometimes you're dead even before that. I'm well aware. Hold on. Don't you have to me your name? I might have an alias too, you know. I suppose it's a fair trade. <laughs> Name's Saito Hajime. Saito san. I remember. He's saying you.
長州藩の2位ボリューブリッキがあるようです。キャンプリッキーがあるようです。キャンプリッキーがあるようです。キャンプリッキーがあるようです。キャンプリッキーがあるようです。キャンプリッキーがあるようです。キャンプリッキーがあるようです。I'm gonna go to the pawn shop before I got a flight track by the Shenzhen Gumi team. Mm. He's available now? Welcome, where are we today? I have equipment to sell. Interesting, what do you have to sell? Not these. ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
2009 with virtue. Okay. Where was that? Yes, thank you. Okay, I'm not going to get a move with you. Excuse me. Deal with that. We have a classic. And yeah, I have to deal with it. I can get more virtues too. Oh yeah, while I was around here, I think to apply the dude that looks just like Tomaki. Okay, right here. Hey, you alright? Oh, yes. Sorry you had to see all that. Don't worry about it. Sheesh, that old sensei is so stubborn. He just refuses to acknowledge the way things are going. Did say? I thought he must have been your father. The way he was shouting. Heaven forbid. That's his dojo. I was training there. But eventually our differences of opinion became too much to bear. Then say the current master of an ancient martial arts called the Komaki style. I trained under him since I was a child. Hmm. <coughs> I've never heard of Komaki style. That's no surprise. Since time in many more Time Memorial has been a strictly unarmed form. <sighs> Nowadays, when everyone's strutting around with swords and guns, who the hell cares about their hand to fight? There's probably still value in the training, even without weaponry. Mm. Maybe, but... As things stand now, <coughs> the old man's losing students fast. I don't know how much longer he can keep the dojo open. <coughs> I respect Sensei principles. I do. If they cost him our place of learning, then what was it all for? Hmm. I can see your point, as well as his. What? You understand. Sensei's style is extraordinary. As a student, I would never wish to see it lost to time. I know this may be forward of me, but since you've heard him, me out this far, why don't you try help, helping me convince him? Yeah, that's a great idea. Follow me. Um, but I... <laughs> so we're gonna meet old man Kumaki here in Edo period. I I got a glimpse of her before and he previously he looks exactly the same. <laughs> Although actually this suits him more in this time period. Sensei, you're being senseless. <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> Lumbox, I told you never to come back. <laughs> but but Sensei. Sensei Schmensei, you have no right to call me by that name. Leave my dojo in. Hmm? Who is that? This man shares the same concerns I have. His name's... Um... Saito Hajime. Like the son, right, of course. And well, he's come for a noble purpose, you see. I was just passing by. This doesn't really involve me. Yes, um, he's uninvolved. He's got nothing at all eh? to do with any of this. Wait, what? Eh? Ah, come on! That right! Now you're just dragging outsiders off the street! That, that, that wasn't what I meant to do! Like your son, yes! Forget my feckless and misbegotten student! My name Komaki Momemitsu. I am the heir to the Komaki style. And the master of this dojo. I didn't even know there was a dojo down this way. See, Sensei? How many times have I told you that we need to advertise ourselves to the public? Silence! I'm really child! Now, Slice of Sun! You're a man of significant skill, are you not? Eh? Hmm, hard to say. I can sense just from looking at you that you're proficient with your sword. And you have great potential for other styles of combat. Mm, dot 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 dot. <laughs> Let us make the most of your rival, then. Saito san, I would like you to battle my student here. Eh? Eh? And since you're so eager to incorporate armament into the Gomaki style, I shall permit you to use a wooden sword. Saito san, however, 
I wish to see. Fight empty-handed. Hmm? I don't understand. Hmm. I see what you're planning, old man. Clever. <sighs> what? Somebody fill me in, would you? I come this far. I don't mind having a match with you. Maybe this will help you understand your sensei's point of view. I knew I was right about this one. Now, begin! <laughs> I got a little mustache right below his nose. <laughs> yes, I'm using the brawler stone. <laughs> After letting you attack with RT, press X to appear to perform consecutive attacks until the heat gauge is depleted. <laughs> what the hell? I think you were just a swordsman, Saito-san. True thing, nothing to do with weapon one wield. Great artists can paint with any brush. I understand your frustration, but you're overlooking something. This old man probably has more than enough skill with a sword to take on any samurai. Huh? Is that true, Sensei? <coughs> so then, the fact that he chooses to devote himself to barehanded martial arts means a hell of a lot. I think he wanted you to understand that as a student. Say no more. The words fall on deaf ears with this one. I, I think I made a mistake, Sensei. Have I embarrassed you? If you're starting to question yourself, get back to your training. Every answer you need is right here. <laughs> I'm trying to, sorry, I sound kind of terrible, try to, but I'm trying to do the, you know, sound like the Komaki, you know, Komaki, how he would actually talk, you know, by the way he looks and stuff. <laughs> yes, Sensei. I apologize for all this trouble, Saito-san. Thank you. It's no problem. I just happened to be passing by. As you can see, all I have to my name is this humble dojo. There's little I can offer you in return for your help. Hmm. Although, if you're so inclined to return, I could likely teach you some techniques of the Komaki style. You do that? Even though I'm not one of your pupils? I wouldn't take a gift like that for granted. It would shame me to let talent like yours go unsculpted. And you could even watch over my sad little student here. Sounds good. I'll come by when I have time. Superb! I'll be here! Okay, so, you know, we gotta get do a little training with Komaki, huh? Aha! Welcome back! Get to learn something? Hmm. Teach me. Okay, maybe I'll learn a thing or two from you. Please, teach me. Excellent! Let's begin! I'd first like to review the fundamentals of barehanded martial arts. Against foes armed with weapons. Defensive capabilities are virtually new. Risk of injury is high. To neutralize that risk, avoiding enemy attacks is paramount. For this purpose, we rely on the Komaki Dharma Tumbler. The students will wield wooden swords during this exercise. I have ordered them to be relentless. You must evade their strikes. Alright, got it. Now, are you ready? Begin! So I guess just doing more like evasive moves. Or evading with A, press A or you know, stick plus A to roll away from danger. Awesome. Or did you? I will do! A Maki Dharma Tumblr has been unlocked. You can learn it by inserting your soul orb into a co corresponding spot slot in the abilities menu. <laughs> hmm. 
It can be challenging to find the right opening, but with time, I should be able to make it work. Very good. You're a quick study. Turn. I'll find something new to teach you. Okay. Okay. Uh, let me see, take my leave now. And I, I do have some, some soul orbs to fill up. Oh yeah, one training orb. I think. <laughs> Who should I load? Maybe I'll add some to the brawler. <coughs> Health increase. I could definitely use that. Gosh, only is just a like barely like quarter inch that they give you. What a jip. <laughs> I still need more orbs. What was that um size of size wheel place? It's around here somewhere. I find that five wheel What do you sell here? Welcome! Can I get you anything today? What have you got? Have a look if you please. Oh, I guess these like materials. Oh, Alright, flower. Just one game, tell you. Let me get some of that. Hmm? Forgive me. Is your first time at my establishment? Yeah, it is. Ah, good. I didn't recognize you. And for a moment feared that I'd forgotten the face. Eh? I don't understand. Do you mean you remember everyone who shopped here? Yeah. Of course! It is my personal philosophy that all my customers be treated with reverence. That's impressive. In this area, you must receive hundreds of people coming in. Haha! <laughs> -ha. I deal in all sorts of odds and ends. Even with the thousand patrons, I'll endeavor to recall each name and face. Names and faces, huh? Like the exemplary service, if you can manage it. My name is Saito. Saito Sama, is it? I will etch it into my memory. Please come again. You have formed the bond with Ichikura owner. You can keep him up here. Find that price we all play here. Where is it? That's a shrine. Is it that one maybe? <coughs> it was wrong, you know. Ah, 
you won't die. You might get caught. Huh? I'm stopping this. I'm stopping this. You're not doing anything here else be here before you take me on. Listen to this, dip sheep. Fine, you're done for. Solid. I'm sorry, I swear. I'm real sorry. Okay, okay, yeah, you better be. Let's go back to that wood cutter guy. Do a little, do a little more wood chopping fun. Hi. Hello, old man. Ah, you again, boy. Feel up with some more chopping? Including what you've already done for me? I'm gonna need about 100 pieces total. Here I do. Fine, set the log. Yeah, let's chop. Chop, chop. Music to my ears. Grab the axe, boy. A hundred this time, huh? Ah, sorry, I missed it. Darn it. <laughs> I just, I just lost the streak, man. Ah, not again. <laughs> I didn't mean for that to happen. <laughs> ah, I missed it again. <laughs> uh, sorry, I do like I'm still concentrating. You do like, no. Ah, no, it's too soon. <laughs> hmm. Ah, darn it again. <laughs> okay, I still need like thirty. <laughs> Okay, well now I need like 15 more. Run. What? Okay, be quiet now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
four. Yes. Hundred. All done. <laughs> yeah, that was, uh, that was pretty <coughs> tricky. Eh? Have you done it? Hmm. Hmm. The what? On my count, you chopped me over a hundred pieces, like I asked you to. Here, let me get you a share. You will pay for the pizza we chopped. Yeah, I need. Oh, I didn't realize I chopped so much wood already. You're dead, boy. Thank you. But, you know, the fire we requests are coming in strong now, and my back is exactly fully healed. What do you say? <laughs> I'd be just saying that to get him to come do it more wood and try to kind of guilt trip into it. <laughs> well, it has been good training. Sure, count on me. That's my boy. Here, a little something extra to celebrate your achievement. Dang ancient amulet. Sure about this? Mm. What am I gonna do with the damn thing? Put to good use. Yeah, okay. See what the, this um, amulet does. Okay, equip it. Oh, the inventory. Is it ancient amulet? In the description, I think. <coughs> mm. oh, let me see, Smith and Dyke. <coughs> well, I'm not enough to hit them yet. So. Armors and stuff, see. Found where that price feel place is. I see you. Hey, kitty, kitty, kitty. <laughs> hey, wh where are you licking? Hey, that's nasty. <laughs> that's a dojo I was. Find out. Can't find that price real quick. Oh, maybe. Oh, there it is. Ah, no. I got about three, four tickets, so might as well. Spend the price real Excellent. Let's see what's in store for me. Right there, I'll take the quick, real quick. Okay, go ahead and give it away. Oh wow! Six, four, five. Better luck next time. Yeah, this is a good one. Let's do it again. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Third prize. Congratulations. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. 
Yeah, we need it. Yeah, let's go. Darn. I get the green. Okay, maybe two. Ooh, I got a white one this time. Congratulations! That's the second prize we know. Spirit Sake. <laughs> so I guess we're stopping by. Come back soon. Oh, I wanted to see what the prize is. You have to have the ticket to be able to see them. Okay, well now I know where the uh, prize deal is. It's uh, tricky to find. Oh, where is this place? I guess it's where they make the sake. <laughs> Who's that little kid there? <laughs> what the? Is that a, a kid or like a miniature <laughs> dwarf? <laughs> ah, this stinks! Why does everybody get to get have fun? Oh, got a phone call. Give me a, give me a moment. Does everybody else get to have fun? What about? What about? What about me? He's like, what the heck? <laughs> oh, don't kill me! What makes you think I do that? Oh, um, I'm so sorry. What was all that what about me stuff just now? Huh? You were talking to yourself. Play about something down there, like oh, um, no worries if you don't want to talk about it. Sorry to bother you. It's uh, I wanna, I wanna play with the others too. A junk boy. 
Oh, what's this story on here? My parents are really strict and stuff. I never get the toys all the other kids get. No pinwheels or bubble markers. Bubble makers. Not even spinning tops. You want to make it in this town? It's really important to have the same toys as everyone else. <coughs> but my mom and dad just don't understand. It's so dumb. I see. I guess kids have it pretty rough. We do. Like even today. Everyone was playing with their spinning tops. I was the only kid who didn't have one. <laughs> so that's why you were all soaking by yourself. Yeah. To be honest, I don't know much about being a kid these days. Is that <laughs> Is having the same toy as everyone else really that important? Of course it is. I mean, think about it. If you don't have a sipping top, you can't exactly play along. I don't know if that's true. Huh? Of course it is. Well, even if you don't have a spinning top, I'm sure you can still enjoy spending time with your friends. You can be a judge or cheer on or something. Uh... Hmm. And even then, maybe you could borrow one from them? Have you tried that? No, I don't have anything for them to borrow in return. There's an inherent lack of incredible exchange. What kind of friendship is that? <laughs> Those are some pretty big words you're using. Uh... If I had something to offer them first, I could probably borrow their toys. Oh. Hey, I know, mister. You know, you got a name. Mister, is there anything I bring out that you don't want? Something I don't want? You'd really be okay with anything? <laughs> yeah, whatever you got. Maybe you didn't know, mister. But us kids can turn just about anything into a toy. <laughs> oh. Right then. So, so please, I'll take anything you don't want. Seriously, anything. Give him something. What should I hand over? Maybe give him that scrap paper? Maybe this will help. We can make paper airplanes. Of this. What is this? No good? Okay, how about... <laughs> this is awesome! Well, what the heck is it? <laughs> Things like that work? Sure why though. Thanks, mister. I'm gonna go show this off to the others. Oh, alright. We'll talk more later, okay? Well, you can uh, make like paper airplanes or like origami with that. I'm sure you know how to do that, right? You have formed the bond with the junk boy. You can deepen your bond by interacting with them and filling the bond games. You can also check this out in the queue. Try to visit them off. <laughs> okay. Another person I gotta be friends with. <laughs> if this is like a brewery where they make all the sake. Okay. How about if I go... And cross the way? No. Change my Great, I think so too. Hang on. Stun unit. Inventory capacity, yes. That's what I could use. I could definitely use it. <laughs> okay, well. Maybe I'll go pay another visit to Mr. Komake. Well, be on the ground. Right, Sitty. Maybe I'll give it that to the little boy next time. Yeah, here. Okay, Komake, let's see what you have. Anything new for me to work on today? Ah, welcome back. Care to learn something? Teach me. Please, teach me. Excellent. Let's begin. 
This time, all of you learn a technique which can dramatically shift the tide of battle to put you on the offensive. Gone over avoiding attacks from armed adversaries. This is suited for empty handed foes or those wielding blunt instruments. Fists and small weapons are simple to use, therefore, your enemies may become rather persistent. Against ceaseless attacks, your defensive stance will eventually break. Thus, you must employ the Komaki knockback. So, what you're saying is I need to guard against my enemy's attacks and find a chance to repel them. So, trivia matter. For a fighter you are to excel. I've instructed my student to attack you with the Interminal Furby. Furry. Utilize the knockback to create opportunities to counter them. Now, are you ready? Begin! Okay, oh, I guess kind of like a parry. It's <laughs> another fancy way of saying parry. <laughs> While guarding with LB, press Y to deflect the enemy's attack and gain the chance to strike back. If they, I can apply that to others in fighting style. Prodigious! That will do! A monkey knockback has been unlocked. You can learn it by inserting a soul orb. Knockback has excellent utility, though the potential to damage your opponent is limited. You must be sure to exploit the openings it creates. Right, I understand. Very well. That will be all for now. Okay, thank you for your time. Maybe I'll go meet that junk boy again. Maybe I'll give him the price ticket this time. Oh, there's another shiny object there. <laughs> there's something on the ground. Price ticket. Oh, you're there again. <laughs> How did I miss that before? Price ticket. Oh, you got one more here. Wow, they're all over, please. Seems like it's a little bit slow too when he picks up items. Why do you always that long pause? Man? Starting to see like like starting to see a little more and more flaws with this Unreal Engine. Hey, Mister. Hmm. Oh. Hey, kid. <laughs> Thanks for giving me that toy. Me and the other kids play with it all day long. Gosh, what did you do with the scrap of paper? <laughs> like, they play with that thing all day. Yeah, that's something else. Glad to hear it. Yeah, you're the best, Mister. But um. I kind of wanted to ask you something. Can you give me another thing you don't want? Hmm. Anything wrong with what I gave you last time? No, there's nothing wrong with it, but... I've never been able to play with the other kids because I never had the right toys. I always see what else we can do. Oh, <coughs> I think I get it. Please, I'll take whatever. So, can I have something? Give him something. Maybe I'll give him the price ticket so you guys can play the price we own. And play with whatever you win there. <coughs> Is it available here? I'm giving that. Let me say I see that. Oh, doesn't actually go here. Hmm. I can't give these away. <coughs> no, 
Oh, I did get it on the way. Yeah, can I give away the price again, unfortunately? I think I'll give him this one. I do have another one. Here. this wow well, what's this no good okay how about <laughs> no this is super cool but what is it <laughs> he likes this thing too again no idea why thanks mister i'm gonna go show the others right away oh all right i'll talk to you later okay see ya Okay. All right, I guess I'll go ahead and turn in for today. Who is that guy running around? Looks like I can <laughs> <That's> <laughs> just run around. Ah, this is where we were fishing. Good deal. <gasps> what am I gonna do? <sighs> Looks like it's finally time to pack it in. The fisherman seems kinda down. <sighs> what am I gonna do? You okay? I'm kinda blue. Oh yes. It's just I had to bring a fish back home with me today. Or else I have to give up my passion for good. <laughs> you mean you'll have to quit? I love fishing probably more than most. Only trouble is, I'm terrible at it. I haven't caught a single fish since the day I first cast out. Daddy. Wait, not even one? Not one. What's worse, my wife just loathes how it swallows up all my time and effort. I work my tail off and can't even bring home a decent meal. He finally decided enough is enough, so I made a promise that if I didn't show up with a fresh cast after today, I'd never fish again. That's rough. <sighs> Even today, I've got nothing. Not even a twitch of the old rod. At this rate, my fishing days are sunk. Hey, there's a dot. This may sound strange, but do you fish? Um, yeah. Now and then. I beg you, can I have some of your fish? Small as you've got, even. <coughs> you want my fish? Well, I can't ask anyone else. Please, you'd be doing me a huge favor. I guess I can help him out. Uh. Alright. If I find myself in any extra, I'll get him to you. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, thank you. You're a lifesaver. As a matter of fact, I do have some um, um, seafood in my um, inventory that I've just been carrying out for no reason. But it doesn't seem like I, can, I can't really do anything <laughs> with it. It's not, not like I can eat it. <laughs> so, I'll suddenly try to catch some fish on my own, of course. Still, please, let me know if you got anything to spare. Oh, give him. How's it going? They biting? <laughs> no, <laughs> not today. Offer fish. Should I hand over? I'll give him this. Be bream. Highly valued even in ancient times. Many regard it as a symbol of good luck. You say sometimes it also re um, call it a um, rock. It also looks like a rock carver, like a snapper. <laughs> They, they call it sea bream here, so <coughs> I guess I'll give him that. I brought you some fish. Wow! Get the load with this one! Okay, this has got to be the last time. He's bound to believe me now. Dang, you really saved me, and by the skin of my teeth, no less. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Don't be so modest. I'm hanging on by a thread here. Regardless, thank you so much. You formed a bond with the desperate fisherman. Okay. okay, another virtue point added. 
he's gone to show off to his wife in some catch of the day, which I, actually I gave to him. <laughs> but, you know, anything to help a, a poor guy, that's what I do. In the end now. See if there's any uh, shiny object. <laughs> oh, I thought that was it, but it was just a small little reflection. On that light. A light streak. <laughs> oh, that's also me blinking. <laughs> yeah, that's really uh, tri trippy there, that little light streak. <laughs> Anything here? I wonder if I can talk to you. Nope. Is that what oh. I want to talk? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I can talk to her. Oh, oh, oh yeah, there's something. Oh no. That's a light streak too. Darn it. Yeah, there's a little hole. Yeah, I guess I just go up then. <coughs> go up to my room. <coughs> ah! I'm done for! What? That scream sounds like it came from this room. What's going on in there? For all I know, something's horrible going down inside. Hey, everything alright? I'm coming in. Oh. <sighs> Papers? It's all over for me. There's nothing more to do but to accept my death. Daddy. Hey, get hold of yourself. What's going on? <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> I'm another guest of this inn. I heard you shouting through the wall. What are you so loud? Ah, uh, forgive me, sir. Please accept my gruesome death as penance. Yeah. I'd rather not. Can I ask what's happened? You seem pretty fed up. Mm. Well, in truth, I'm trying to write a story. Mm. That's it? Pardon me, my good man. I should have introduced myself earlier. My name is Natsumi Sosaku. I'm an author. Really? never met an author before. Yeah. Sadly, it's no great feat, particularly as my knit pen has run utterly dry of inspiration ink, so to speak. <laughs> oh, the deadline for my novel fast approaches and I have yet to even decide on the story's very foundation. I submit. <laughs> this is my sole recourse. Please, send my apologies along with my obituary to the printing office. Death of the author. <laughs> So, that's why you're making all this noise? You have writer's block? Man, look at the mess you made. You're not even gonna mention about the mess in that room? <laughs> <coughs> Never mind. Perhaps instead, you would be so kind as to offer me some advice. Eh? Me? What good would my advice be to you? Well, if nothing else, you are a fellow guest of my esteemed Teradaya. That makes us colleagues of a sort. Mr. Naito. Sorry, but I'm not really well read. Yeah. Please, I would sooner breathe my last than rely solely on the so-called wisdom of academics. What I need comes not from the mind, but the soul. I seek inspiration for my story. Inspiration, huh? Ah. <sighs> well, you see, I have a vague concept, but the world's much might give it shape and lose me. Yeah. What's your idea? Well, I envision a fanciful tale told from the perspective of a humble animal. Alright, so an animal is your main character. Exactly, my good man. I thought, perhaps this creature could observe our daily human activities with keen humor. However, I am at loss as to what manner of beast would best suit this purpose. I imagine this title. I am but a... something. <coughs> hmm. And you need to decide what kind of animal the protagonist should be. 
I think um, that could. I think with that kind of the uh, cat would be the perfect animal. Yes, one healthy in its own mind, yet lonely in human estimation. Have you any insight? Yeah. Cat might be funny. Cats are funny. <laughs> A cat? Yes, I find them amusing as well. Cats are not unlike humans, yet the ways in which they differ from us can be profound. I am but a cat. It's perfect! <laughs> yeah, glad I could help. All that is left is to do is put pen to paper. I believe the words will come easily now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, work hard and try not to keep begging for death. <laughs> I guess I'll come back later. Yeah, I'll come back later. But where am I supposed to go? I guess this is where my room at. Oh, wait, that's my room. <laughs> it's like right in front of the stairs. Oh, I can change clothes. Change the witch outfit. I already. <laughs> Oh, this is Oh, she's out. Wow, that's it, Paul. Well, I'll change that later. Go ahead and take a rest. I'm meeting the information information broker today. Should I rest until then? Rest. Yes. Time to rest. And maybe I'll go check back on the uh, rider later afterwards. Sorry, evening. Had to get to the bathhouse in South Yashikima. Head to the bathhouse. I don't like this uh, pause in between them. See, with the Dragon Ninja, you, it can actually there's no like um pause between the loading in each section. You can go straight. <coughs> okay, let me check back on this guy first. Yes, yes, yes. All right, like my life depends upon it. This is the essence of literature. Hmm. Should let him work. Maybe I'll come back later. Sounds like he's doing all right. <coughs> Guess I'll just head over to the um, bath house then. Another price ticket. Pick that up. Put the underground. Price ticket. And five. Hey, old man. Oh, I'll talk to you later. Oh, yeah. On the other side. And that's the bathroom. Right here. So this is the bass house. Enter. Yeah, enter. Hard to believe there's a real information broker here. <laughs> yeah, this is the infamous the bass house scene from the Ishin. Yeah, everyone. Most talked about ever of this game. The original game, that is. I heard that some uh, really unfortunate thing like happens in, in this um, remake. We're, we're about to see. Like it caused a quite a stir and controversy among the fans. Please make your acquaintance. We hope you enjoy your visit, Mr. Nibori. The path is just ahead. Right this way. Okay. Here it is, the bath house. 
most, one of the most talked about. And you know, I did watch the original, the, the from the first game on on YouTube. I didn't, I I haven't played the original because you know they they only have their available in Japan. Whoa, they got them. <laughs> well, I see them. Ew, I don't want to see that old old like blubbery um, butt right there. I want to see the real man butt. <laughs> But it's all, <laughs> yeah, they so like convenient, so it's all like strategically like covered it. <laughs> the, <laughs> the manhood. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just you and <laughs> yeah, get the muscle on him. Yeah. You're the bathkeeper of Sa. And you, Saito Hajime. This is the florist. <laughs> He was the judge of own <laughs> He went to his own purgatory back in Kamurocho. Okay. <laughs> well, the water's nice. <laughs> Just don't pee in that. <laughs> you know, that would be so good. Yo, Nibori told you this. I want to know why you're after this guy in the first place. It's perfect to keep that private. Even if it costs me extra. Running like you should be glad you can afford me at all. Of course, if it's instant, it's not your money. He bought his foot at the bell? Yeah, he did. Who is he, Zach? Nibori Matsuzuke, Matsuzuke is a man from Tokyo. That's really all you need to know. <coughs> really? Even though you're the one I hear about most I feel like young people. The graphic is an unreal engine. He, even here, it's like kind of like subpar compared to the one from them. Um, the, the, you know, Yakuza Zero and Kiwami. <laughs> you know that one, with those two games, they were, they didn't, they hadn't used the Dragon Engine yet. But even then, that their their game, with the graphics was like, even more like crisp and like <laughs> more polished than this. You know? Yeah, yeah. I would say I'm not really big fan of this like, Unreal Engine. I hope they don't come. I hope they don't um, continue using this. Because they just um, you know, stick to the Dragon Engine. The purpose is to maintain what I'm doing the box of goods back. Okay, about the Shinzenko. <coughs> Wait, you don't need this. Yup. Organization none other than the Shinzenko. That rowdy Shiken bunch are now in charge of the government. Shishi slaughtering brigade. They're like the military police of the, this Edo era. But not as, um, I guess, more, not as, uh, or, still not as organized as the uh, actual military. Somehow they still operate under their own weapons. <coughs> all the names of the Correct. I guess they're not really like um, not wouldn't say it's like they're more like mercenaries rather than like, uh, military police. <laughs> that would make more sense. <coughs> Officers you mentioned, did any of them travel to Tosa last year? Huh? Why would I know something like that? Did anyone know for that matter? So it's a Shinsengumi no They get extremely close to the Shinsengumi to try that. That takes time. 
<笑>いや、<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> That's hot! Well, I mean, oh, the other two seem fine with that. I don't know why. <laughs> what the... I don't see why you can't handle it. <laughs> I don't know who you think you are. You got one hell of an attitude. Say what? <laughs> Here it comes. <laughs> See you later. Yeah. Oh, that wise guy. Who's got a hell of an attitude? Say that again to my face. You don't like my attitude? Get your hands off me. But this ends very badly for you. Go ahead and make my day. <laughs> it's gonna be a brawl. Boy. Hey. It's about to get ugly in here. <sighs> Way to ruin a good time. Well, we, we don't mind a good, like, manly fight in the bathhouse. <laughs> in their... In their birthday suit. <laughs> I guess that's what you call it. <laughs> Well, this is a fight for all the ages. <laughs> Large man. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't have a name yet. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> see how the uh, their um, <laughs> all the steam is like strategically, strategically like covering their <laughs> um, <laughs> privates. <laughs> Gosh, I wish they were actually um. <laughs> I wouldn't mind seeing them. <laughs> Yeah, well, anyway, let's fight. Hey! Oh, shoot. Oh, good combo. Yeah, let's try to. Ah, oh, alright, press A, what happened? What is that the deal? Oh, he can't grab. Won't let me grab. I guess. 
I could grab by the hair. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Uh, this is the part that you know, people complained about. They were supposed to actually show uh, the. Yeah, yeah, this is what happened. This is what they were complaining about. <laughs> I thought they were original too. Like, they actually showed the, the, the bare buns, you know, but somehow the. I think it's just the way this um, fog you know, was rendered in this um, engine, that's why. Uh, it didn't really, um, it got you know, more like a uh, covered up than it should have been. So, a lot of people went to hell happy about it. <laughs> ah, geez. I almost have it. Alright, uh, he blocked that, that's all. Yes, I can. Well, at least I got it. No. Loin cloth. Oh, yeah. I guess I finally. That's a piece of um, <laughs> armor I can uh, cover myself with. Alright. Who are you? So it's a okay, the same. Oi. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Who let both of you? Well, it's okay to uh, cover your part, but uh, <laughs> I wanted to see <laughs> more dares of the the buns at least. <laughs> How about you let me buy you a drink? <laughs> yeah, the fog is a little too dense here. You know. But yeah, a lot of you know a lot of the people who had originally played this game and you know complained about this scene and in this remake. Because you know, the fog was like just came out too dense. That's why they <laughs> weren't able to show show that yeah, explicit part. To, no, no, it's, it's night time. There's a night light. And good old, um, where is it? It's kill, right? And this is the Edo night light. <laughs> what about like um, thousand years from now? It's gonna be. They're all gonna be like you. Know, Big bosom hostesses in like skimpy skirts yeah. <coughs> and cabarets. You know, you're surprisingly generous. <laughs> He's still referred to as large men. Speaking of, I hardly ever treat other men. Crazy, eh? Let me have taken a real liking to you. Well, you didn't get a chance to bond in that bathhouse <laughs> in an <a> unusual <laughs> way. <laughs> I'm not nearly drunk enough to talk about my past. Oh crap, you're drinking more than I am. Okay, at least say what you're buying for the bathkeeper. You don't need me to tell you. After all, you were there to hire me to go, weren't you? Yeah, if it wasn't for your A showing up, I'd have had my chance. Alright, I'll tell you what I want if you tell me what you want. How's that for you, dear? Sorry, I'll have to pass. Fine, be that way. At least I got nothing to hide. <coughs> Here's what I want. Look at this Hinsengumi tree. Taunt and stun you. Him again? You got a real sheep eater too. You got a sheep eating grin. The reason I was pissed at the bathhouse is all because of you. <laughs> 
あったのか You've met him. This is Kondo Isan. Yeah, I met him. A couple of hours before our little workout. Now he used to be a damn peasant. Now he's a damn man. Even before the guy's balls dropped, he's been training in some kind of stuff. It's Tenerishin style. Yeah, that was it. Gotta say. For you, they want to be samurai. It was all for real and cook. <coughs> what a day, Spin. First I meet in Kondo, then you. Is I attract the strongest of the strong. <laughs> what's, that, what's with that girl? <laughs> she's like a... Just, <laughs> I don't know, I think she's like petrified. I guess, I guess, like, she's never seen the... I guess, this dude, this Japanese dude with the golden hair. <laughs> but it is kind of unusual to see him. They would think um, he's like a foreigner or some sort. He's actually Japanese. <laughs> Could always be in Kumi Barracks. Or if not that. I can join the Shinsengumi out. <laughs> or that. What route did you take? Then? <laughs> Part of the barge in there, I'm sure. I'm sure. You're the one looking for me. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. What's that? What's that? Just who are you? Nani mon nanda. Should I ask that soon? See, I can just kick it. And once that happens, you need me a lay. Your girls are the best. That's like the papers where I'm from. Let me tell you. That's so mean. Answer your quest. Commander of the Satsuma Army. Saigo Kikinosuke. And the Satsuma Army, Saigo Kichinosuke. <coughs> Satsuma no Saigo Kichinosuke. Funa. Got it? Izure Mata. See you around. <coughs> Godonji does okay, not know. Satsuma Hari comes to Satsuma. I know Saigo says they know she's the one who calls you all the shots. Uh, okay. It quite a few enemies over time. They put on the Osaka dialect. I almost never get to know him. And in my opinion, they take it quite a shy to him. Oh yeah, he yeah, has indeed. <laughs> Did I see how that went down? How that came to be? <laughs> I should go back to Terra and see. Yeah. You're a bit drunk too now. Okay. What? Oh. Oh. What happened yet? What's all that commotion? The sub story again? I don't know. Okay. Oh, no, then that guy. Um, I. なんなんだ、なんなんだ。で、俺だ、トーサ。ベロトーサ。ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、
ラーメンわしは敵じゃありませんリョーマさんあんたとやり合うつもりはないき。ムクロガイが来ていただけますかムクロガイ。場所は寺田屋の人間に来てはわかります。俺に何の用だ来ればわかりますき。でも。That's Nishiki. Yeah. He used to be. And here he used to be a member of the Tosa Loyalist Party. Strange man knew my name. He wants him to go to Murokai? He can't fire his place at Teradai. Oh, the little boy is still there? Okay, let's see what can I give him now. Oh, yeah, I got a gear I can equip. Why not? <laughs> they call it Bruce play Well, it gets 173 defense. It's better than nothing at all. I have to do with that for now. Still can't um, equip this yet. Uh, let's figure out how to do that. Oh, yeah, I got some. Oh, I got a brawler or. For him, add more. What's me? This is a finish. Oh, that one. We're playing Grim Orchid. Okay, what's on you? Dancer. All up point blank got shot with terrifying jumping flash consumes it. RP near it. Take that. Yeah, start using some more um well that's just that. Oh by the way, let's see what, what inventory should I Oh, I actually got a fair amount of this fish is steel metal sheet and this gold gold scrap too. Oh, I got one of everything else. So. I'll give him one of these um silver and one of the silver scrap. This iron yeah. Get him in the dealer. Then crafting it too. Give him one of this uh, silver, silver step. I guess. Oh, hey, mister. Did you even be up this late at night, boy? <laughs> I don't need to read through this again. Give him something again. No <laughs> respect. I'm not sure what you could do with that, but I'm sure plenty.
you know, stand your chance against me. Oh yeah, good. No. Learn another Komaki style. Give yourself a bit of time to hone that last technique and make it yours. Turn to me after engaging and say, three more battles. They will proceed with your training. I'll be looking forward to seeing you further refine your abilities. I guess three more battles? I guess. I don't know, is that the main story battle or just uh, like the random street battles that I, I get myself into. We'll see. I guess we should continue until I deal with this. Okay, uh, I just cut. Wrong one. <laughs> the fisherman's still there too. You alright? Uh, it's you! Please! Can you spare a couple more fish? Nani. The wife's still on your case, huh? <sighs> Unfortunately, yes. When I brought that fish home last time, she wrote it off as a fluke. Of course, it was just the fish you've given me, which, frankly, makes it even worse. Please, can you spare me some more fish? Just until my wife's confident in me. Offer fish. Nani. Oh, I still have a sea bring. I'll give him a squid this time. Oh! That is a lively one! Okay, this should do its trick. I'm sure she'll believe my fishing skills this time. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you enough! <coughs> do I still have them? Well, oh, I actually have two. So, I guess I can give it one more later. I have another ability here. Uh, I'm not. Training. So. What should I do this time? Maybe I'll add something to the brawler. Attack speed boost. Back to the end. You're back rather early tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you say. By the way, how do I get to Mukurogai? You don't go there, you end up there. End up how, exactly? That place is a desecrated stone, not even a government official set. Only criminals and vagrants call it home. The first thought, corpses are settled about. The pickpockets are reversing through them. You should take me to it, or at least close by. I did not hear what I did. No one in the right mind would want to go there, for any reason. But I have to go. <laughs> I'll do it, Oryo-chan. You leave him to me. Simply watch the fall. The trouble start brewing. I'll pat on like a bat out of hell. Anything will help. Fine. I'll pretend I heard nothing. Alright, Mr. Let me know when you're ready. Then we'll make our departure. Hold on just a second. Oh, I'll check on the writer first. Wait, let's hold off a little. Just tell me when you're ready. I'm not going in. Got it. Are they here? Oh. <laughs> this is over here. All this room not to me. Wonder if he's able to finish his new story. Check him out. Man. Natsumi, are you in there? Still messy as usual. Saito-san, 
I owe you a great deal of gratitude for your help. Yeah. I don't think I did all that much. Yeah. Nonsense. Without you, I never would have been able to finish my novel on time. Oh, you made your deadline? I'm glad. Indeed, which reminds me, I've received quite a number of letters from those who've read it. Oh, that was fast. <laughs> that's, that's one like one really uh, speedy like uh, printer. Yeah, you know, and the book went out that fast too. Hmm, that was fast. Also, response this. Reception from I am but a cat has been <laughs> astonishingly good. People love the idea of setting a novel from the perspective of a cat. That's great. It's all thanks to you, Saito san. Here, I'd like you to have this. A gift. Game Broken Compass. Now, as a result of its success, I've already accepted a commission for my next novel. Hmm. You've become quite an accomplished author. Yeah. I wish that were so. I would have achieved nothing, however, without your intervention. <sighs> I feared my next work will only disappoint. With not too much trouble, I will welcome more of your perspicacious. Perspicacious. Well, that, that's like a really hard. <laughs> Like what? Never heard that word before. Perspicacious advice. Uh. I got no problem with offering a suggestion. But I really don't know how helpful they'll be. <laughs> That's all I ask. So, once again, the basic idea for my take. What kind of story is it this time? Well, the main character is a school teacher. So he's a brash and reckless young man. And he, in his tenure, finds himself ensnared in a battle of wit and will by the strong personality which surround him. He falls prey again and again to adversity, either through a happenstance or as consequence of his own in intractable sense of morality. Ultimately, he resigns and finds a more peaceful life elsewhere, having at last outgrown his childish predilection for errors and botches. Sounds interesting. Why aren't you... What are you? What aren't you sure about? Mm. Well, he needs a nickname. Eh? Huh? That's it. That's it. Yes. Plan for the entire cast of characters to be known by Subriquets. Subriquets. The real name is due by the narrator. Our protagonist should be called something familiar and evocative, and that will serve too as a novel title. Mm. Hmm. The protagonist nickname and also the title. Yeah, indeed. The Great Gallivanting Disaster, Watch Time, where he should be an animal. <coughs> <coughs> hmm, I don't know, that doesn't sound to be Great Gallivanting. Uh, I don't think another animal would be. How about Watch Time? Let's try that. Watch Time? Sorry, that's. That's the first name that came to mind. <laughs> Bachan, say. It's true. Much of his misfortune is due to his own principles and the rough shot way he applies them. And since the novel follows him from boyhood, something that reminds the reader of his youth throughout his journey is quite fitting. Bachan is a splendid title. A right with inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> Glad I could help. This is going to be ten times the novel that I'm with something or other ones. Let's get writing before death claims me at last. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Alright. We're carding. Give the death thing a rest. Yeah? <laughs> okay, so. Guess I'll have to come back to them again later. Guess I'll I'll head on over to my own. To Mukurokai. Did I save? Yeah, I'll go ahead and save. Because I want to. Save it right. Right over that. Why does it take. Why does it have to take like several button pushes to exit out of that menu? It's weird. What? You ready, mister? I'm ready. Let's go. Uh, I like your hat, by the way. Your raiding, raiding hat. <laughs> Ooh, nice river. Okay. Thanks, what do you mean, Mukurokai? 
Let's just say I didn't invite it. Oyobi? Invited it. But now, it's like Right. There's some, someone I need to meet them. Huh. I had a feeling this might be the case. Listen, fella. Can you know why this place is called Mukorokai? Huh? Do tell me. Love to know the reason. Its real name is Rokumon. Long time ago, was the biggest temple in all of Rakugai. A famous monk resided there. He took him runaways and people with incurable disease. Society is weakened. Eventually, a plague slipped through the temple, and all who lived there died. They had to be buried quickly. But if you dig around there, you'll find enough gold to fill up the temple. That's why now everyone knows us Mukuroka, Dead Man's Quarter. These days have been nothing but a haunt for outlaws. As such, I suggest you don't stay long. Look sharp, it's just up ahead. Oh, that really is a slum, huh? Sorry to drag you out there. Got any plans to get back? Not yet. You can head back first. Hey. Got it. Okay, let's see what unfolds here. <laughs> hey, chicken. Oh. <laughs> uh, he's, he's dead drunk. Ah, yeah. Yeah, cheap bastard. What the, what the freak is this? Got a problem, guy? Yeah, you. <laughs> Time for you to cut it out. Don't like it? Bring it on. Oh, you think you're gonna teach me, huh? Just freaking try. They're what? Bare hand is a trying to roll. Oh, you. Oh, I should have eaten something before I came here. But... Ah, it hurts. I'm sorry, all right? Please, just let me go. <laughs> Hey, look at that pretty chicken. Right here, my nugget. <laughs> a... Over here. Oh, it looks like a gambling hall. Okay. okay. Is there any. Well, I, d I doubt there's any restaurant or anything that sort here because it's, it's a bomb after all. She's so hoggy, but... Mm. <coughs> <coughs> oh, yeah. That's a little fun guy, at least. Okay. There goes nothing. Nice to meet my mysterious, uh... Or friend or whatever. The man who got... Uh, welcome to hell, stranger. Give us your money, we'll spare your life. Go on your ways too. 
なるほど。お前だったのか。いいぞ。いいぞ。いいぞ。いや、兄。兄弟も一緒ってこと。I barely missed that. I came so quick. I can't really block with this. I did it! <laughs> I think thanks. This um for my it's a uh, thanks to my uh, weapon. It's a it has a very high um uh damage. <laughs> they say you fight like a killer now. Makes me wonder if you're picking any lies up to really close up. Who can tell, right? So, what is this about? I'm going to speak to myself how much you've changed. Also, I can't bring someone right to speak to them. I can't bring someone right to speak to them. Forgive me. Simple protocol. Your brother is here with you and Kyo Ato. Yes. But at the moment, the Shinsengumi is firmly at the base. We've been hiding. I'm not sure where he is. Where is he right now? I'm waiting for you. Keep it in the middle of the floor. You're not going to leave me there? Hmm. I think not. I still can't stand the sight of you. Hmm. So be it. Yes. Brother, you really are here somewhere. I think a place like this exists within the city. Wonder what else lurks inside. Getting used to it here now. Oh. Oh. 
out of here. Eat our shine. Welcome. <laughs> what it'll be? The secret stew. Me. Real bugs and things loaded with veggies. I'll eat that. Yeah. All my favorite dish. <laughs> like secret stew is like a I think I or I ordered that too. I did need to I did manage to work out quite an appetite. Mystery meat stew. Yeah. <laughs> uh who knows what's in there? I mean, it's you know what what do you expect that they would have in a slum like this? <laughs> Surprised they even have a res restaurant. The <laughs> buroku, <sighs> painting stew, secret stew, mystery meat stew. Oh, Kini, I do appreciate it. Yeah. Hey, get all these chickens. Ah, fuck, 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 fuck. Looks like you got kind of kicked out of Tosa too. You got driven out of Tosa. いぞが試すような真似したあるかな。いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、い
彼らは三河の中心として、トマス政府を増やそうとしてるんだ。それこそが、金能なんだよ。兄弟は、本気でそんなことができると思っているのか。どうしたんだ俺は今もおやすさんを切った覆面の男を探しているあの時のあいつの剣さばきを手がかりにしてなあの剣の達人だったおやすさんを切るほどの腕そうだね主だった大流派にはない剣筋それでたどり着いたのか天然離心流だった天然離心流江戸近くの市営館という道場でのみ伝承された流派使い手はそう多くはないそして今日その流派の人間の所在が分かったどこなんだ新鮮軍だ新鮮組局長近藤勇が今の天然離心流宗家だ新鮮組だぞそれじゃあ,あの近藤勇が土佐まで来てお休みを殺したってのかいや天然離心流の使い手は近藤一人じゃない新鮮組幹部の大半が天然離心流の使い手なんだ俺はその中で例の覆面の男がいると思ってなるほどなだから今そいつを見つけ出すために新鮮組の懐に入り込むつもりだ<笑>ななんだと What's that now? リョウはお前は何て言った俺は新選組に入隊するお前自分が何言ってるか分かってたかもう決めたんだ情報用を使って調べられることは全部調べたこの先覆面の男を追うには他に手がないダメだ危険すぎるお前は俺と一緒にいるんだ今の俺の力なら、お前が土佐に戻れるようにもできる。もうこれ以上、お前は犯人を追う必要はない。復讐は忘れろ。それに新世組に入ったとしてどうやって復讐を忘れろ。顔もわからん。声もわからんってどうしようもねえだろ。一度は命を得るときに相手だ。そいつと一緒に行くときに相手だ。どんな理由があろうと、no、俺は、親さんを殺したかもしれない奴らと組む気はねえ。んだと What are you implying? あんたは目的のためだ。誰とでも組む。どんな手でも使うってのか。よ
If really they want to change toast, they must take down the Bafuku. There's no other path to submit for me or Goshilakis. You know that as a toast, you're missing my point. And if my dead father were here right now, I'd be telling you were doing everything you could for Tosa. Put your life to his face like that. <coughs> Answer me. And I'm telling him the truth. Nothing to be ashamed of. Not for this. <coughs> what do you imply? <coughs> Let me ask you. Are you proud of what you've been doing all the time, Ryoma? For good as it's done, you running around, looking for pops clearer. You really think some half-baked revenge would do him justice? Half-baked revenge? You heard me. Pop gave us the guidance we need to build a great future. That was a rage-filled obsession that keeps us stuck in the past. <coughs> Tell me I'm wrong, real You're stubborn as they come. They're speculating like this. We could be changing history. Then, are you saying we should move on? Pop's killer is still out there. You just wanna let him go? Never say we should move on. Just... There's a much bigger picture here. That's all I know. The next time I see your face, you are too far gone. I might not be able to call you brother anymore. Sorry, but I can't see the bigger picture like you do. I need to find out who killed him. I need to know why they took him for a life. Tell that day comes. I'll never be able to move on. Okay. <coughs> All right, then we finish chapter two. Go right over that. So. Sorry. Tozao da bunch de ichi ne. Skip that. Chapter three. Meebu wolves. Okay. Got that wolf for meebu. Yeah, you know I. Yeah, I read um, the manga Rural Nikenshin from like back in college, and, and they had some huh? snippets about it. Like Bakumatsu and Shinzengumi, so I'm kind of familiar with those things. But Ninji, you're hovering like that. You're gonna frighten the guests. You won't believe this. I didn't say you said you're going to see Gumi. What? Is this true? Yes. You have lost him. Lost ya. I am roaming the town. Now suddenly you want to leave. I heard the Shinzen Kumi pay well. That's all. And you've been hammering me about my rent, so I gotta do, do something. Oh, I've heard all about that. He died. They're more or less Ronin themselves, but they won't ask about my status as long as I skip. Jack, you finally start paying rent. Are you dense? And so we should pay for ruling boys to kill people? Become a Mibu wolf? What people call the Shinzengumi? Back in the day, it caused total chaos while calling themselves the Mibroshigumi. Vicious wolves of Mibro devoured their own. Or so people would say. Mibroshigumi. 
そうそう、Sorry, but my mind's made up. I'll make sure not to cause you any trouble. <coughs> That's all I have to say on the matter. Yeah, yeah. Oh, ten I remember correctly, the Shinsegui barracks are west of Shijo Street. I suppose I should make my way to Rakunai first. Back to the barracks. Anyway, I'll deal with that. Uh, first, I need to uh, take a quick bathroom break. Yeah. That one I'm still herb or the something unlocked. <laughs> Let's check it out. I 
Did I hang up? Is it here? Okay, that's the one I am. Come on, how do I get there? This thing is so hard to nappy. Nappy. Okay. How do I um? The hard do I um? Unlock the other. Do some training and so. Combat arena somewhere in town. Apparently, it attracts highly skilled swordsmen from all over this country. To the point where duels are happening every day. Some real keen sounding sprites for the winners too. Where is it? Hmm? I don't know. All I heard is some guy over. In... What good old guy runs it? You probably have to poke around there to find out the details. I guess suppose this is the guy goes to if I want to. Or is this sea fishing? You can see fishing from here. This is East Coast, this is the one going to Nicaragua. Oh no, I am fishing. <laughs> uh oh. Uh. I, I had an intended on this. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Got myself a nice little fish. Red sail, fly fire. Wait for that red bar to hit the water. A little more. There! Hmm. Yes. Oh. Ooh, got myself an eel. Found your eel. Hmm. I don't even have a bait, man. I can still. I can see that pretty easy. Come on! I know you can see it. Come bite. See a big one there. Bite me. Okay. Maybe I gotta move a little from closer. Hmm. Wait. Bite me. What? Are you serious? Let's go over here. There's <coughs> still a lot of the like, fast moving fishies there. Look at the water. Ah uh ha! -huh. Wait. <coughs> there! <coughs> yeah. Oh. Emerged. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a little anchovy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was funny. Okay, let me try this guy again. <clears throat> Come on, bite! You big buffoon. I knew you could see me. What? Seriously? Oh, you're one picky little picky booger, aren't you? Okay, that's a. What's the tackle? 
Maybe try that one. <laughs> yes. Come on, count to mama. That's a, looks like a flounder. Uh, right eye flounder. Awesome. Okay. Do I have even, do I even, oh, I guess I do have bait, but never mind. That's, um, let's go. Maybe I've already shared some of my, um, foils with that fisherman, the unlucky fisherman. I play a little bit of fishing, like, like the Yakuza Zero, so I know how it goes. Sure. Still didn't find it, did you? <sighs> Off a fish. Give him the... Give this file fish. Oh, this? Oh! Yeah, it's a lively one! Okay, good luck with that one. See if I can pick up anything. Silver hammer. Ah, yes, Ray gets Ah, you cheat it. I get to um, that um, area anyway. Go on, anyway, let me go. This guy that can be I thought someone welcome back. What have we got? Let's see. Uh, Maybe I'll buy some holy bait. Get one. Mm. Slightly distorted. <laughs> By a couple of these oh, actually, the Dobro gave him a pretty um, no, I'm still linked to it. Uh, Plenty of money to spare. Ah, sir, collecting price tickets? There's one. Thank you, as always. Please come again. Yeah. I wonder if I can sell some of these fishes. There's a fish market here, isn't there? Yeah, fish market. Yes, you can. I'm just gonna sell them. You're just stuck with it. <laughs> oh, Kini. Okay, okay. Yeah, At least they don't seem to really take up room in the 
Uh, let me um get rid of that stupid scrap of paper. This card, yeah. It really is any use for it. What's this? Oh, this is the quality. I'll go ahead and put that in. Send in the story. Right here. I think that's the word for Shinsei Gumi Fairy. Storage. Okay, we can I use those on triple cards. Eh? <laughs> oh, let me go look. Put that on. To find that one. Price wheel, play that price wheel. Oh, yeah, off the tape. It was a bit of a jump for him. Oh, hey, mister. Oh. He's not my friend. Not anymore. You're not getting along? He's the worst. He broke the toy you gave me. I don't need someone like that to be my friend. Did he break it on purpose? No, I don't think so. I mean, he did say he was sorry right away. And you didn't forgive him? No! But that's only because the toy you gave me was really important. I finally got to make friends cause of it. You know, the thing I gave you wasn't a toy. It was just some junk I didn't want. Uh... Yeah, well, I wanted it. So you took good care of it, huh? Yeah. You say you don't need your friend anymore? Are you sure about that? Sometimes, unwanted things can become really important for even the smallest reason. You've seen that yourself. You might say you don't want your friend, but you can't just cut him off. That gives nothing! <laughs> when all said and done, friends like that often end up being what matter most. Sorry. I should go say sorry. Yeah, sounds like a plan. What am I supposed to say? <laughs> <laughs> your kids. You'll make up before you know it, just by playing together. Really? He wants to make up with his friend, but I guess he doesn't know how. Maybe I can give him something to help? Or should I hand over? Mm -hmm. too. <laughs> Maybe he can play with this white bait. <laughs> Alright, you say your toy was broken, right? Take this with you. Now, cut it, I guess. <laughs> what the heck is this? You always give me the weirdest stuff. <laughs> well, yeah, like a, a, a tiny little uh, anchovy fish. You think so? <laughs> Thanks, mister. I'm gonna take this car and go apologize right now. Hey, okay, you. Yeah. Have fun with the little fishy. <laughs> I'm not sure what you can do with it exactly. Hey, just some. Um, Pick it up and dance with it, <laughs> or, just, or just cook yourself a little, uh, little fish girl. <laughs> Rat paper? Seriously? Oh, I'm gonna go pay a visit to the, the writer guy. Oh no! Which way was it again? Hey, something the matter? Oh, excuse me. I don't suppose you happen to know how to get to Ushimi Ichibangai. I have to make a delivery. It's that way. Go straight past Teradaya, then turn right into the shopping district. You'll see it. <laughs> wow! Was I that close already? <coughs> oh hell. Thank you, Samurai-san. <laughs> Frequently lost crew. <laughs> well, it's not far, he'll make it for me. <laughs> I would feel I have to see him again. Well, anyway, yeah. Oh, can I pick up something here? Fine forces me. Okay, now, wait. wait. <sighs> Love struck woman. What should I do? Woman? 
Do you plan to take the ferry? What to do? To go or not to go? Oi. Excuse me, miss. If you think you are going to Mukuroga, don't. You don't know how dangerous that part of the city is. Hmm? I do, but I feel so tempted. Oh, I guess that's how you get uh, go to that uh, slum area. <laughs> Mind if I ask why? Eh. <coughs> well, there's something being sold there. A kind of scented water called perfume. Eh? Yeah. you? Never heard of it. With the talk of the town among us wedding leaves, apparently, why you yourself will make men swing over you. So, it's some sort of love potion. <sighs> That's what they say. I've never been very popular with men, you see. I thought this might finally help. But, this perfume. The only person who sells it is a black market dealer in Mukuro guy. I see. <coughs> Why are you fighting? <coughs> <coughs> I know it's risky, but for a prize like that, I thank him by the courage. Mukuro guy is no joke, especially for a woman at all. Really seems like she might go. Maybe I should buy this perfume thing for her? Why don't you let me go to Mukurokai for you? To be honest, I'm curious about this love pushing speaker. Huh? huh? You'd really do that? Uh. Sure. Leave it to me. <laughs> Thank you. I only know what the... That the merchant is somewhere in the district. I'm sorry I can't be more specific. Here. Here, let me give you the money I have saved up. And three of you. Wow. Must be really expensive. You're free to keep whatever's left. Thank you. Not at all. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Wow. How do I get there again? Uh, not here. Maybe I have to go into the inn? Mm -hmm. Might as well talk to the writer guy. <laughs> Let's see how he's doing. He's working the botch shot, man. The office room, not to me. He's being finished his new story. Hit the button. Thank you, son. I owe you a great deal of gratitude for your help. Yeah. I don't think I did all that much. How did the news story go? <laughs> it's selling very well, actually. That's good to hear. You finished it pretty quickly. What can I say? When inspiration takes hold of me, the word simply manifests. I fixed many letters for my readers again. Watch John truly seems to have struck a chord, chord with the audience. Yeah? What are they saying? <laughs> In so many words, it's a runaway success. People are especially charmed by the protagonist's simple yet absurd nickname. That's great. I couldn't have done it without you, Saito-san. Here, I'd like you to have this. A gift. Obtain fine silk fabric. Now, I confess, I have great urge to strike while the iron is hot and produce something new, quickly. <laughs> eh, already ready to work again, huh? Any ideas? Mm. Yes, indeed, my good man. In this tale, our narrator exchanges mail with an older mentor, whom he affectionately calls Sensei, ultimately receiving the man's written life story. He travels to visit his Sensei, but finds he's passed away. Our main character received his last testament posthumously. The testament recounts Sensei's youth in the country and the relationship he developed as he grew older. What you see, Sensei had a beloved compatriot named Ki, yet Ki adored the woman whom Sensei eventually married. This leads Ki to commit suicide. Many years later, Sensei himself succumbs to grief and takes his own life as well. Mm. Mm. Interesting premise. So, is anything giving you trouble this time? Of course. Once again, I am unable to think of a title. <coughs> Please, Saito-san, I need your advice one more time. Tangle of friendship and romance. Men who commit suicide due to the pain of losing the people they cherish. The story about relationships and emotions. You should call it Heart. 
Cleavage animal part. <laughs> Cleavage. <laughs> It'd be funny if I actually picked that. Animal. Why animal porn? That, that doesn't. I'm just thinking of like animal porn, but it's not. So I think more like logical answer would be heart. 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 It's simple. Poetic. <laughs> I think it's wonderful. Heart. They evoke so much with so little. The yearning heart of the Procadius, his mentor and cave, all witheringly isolated yet united by their humanity. Perfect. Hmm. I think you'll write something great. Nothing scintillates my creativity like a good title. This will be my magnum opus. I'll earn the reprieve from death you granted grant me. <laughs> they were talking about death. I thought he had a moment he was, gonna, he was uh, getting a stroke or something when he said Bindio earlier. <sighs> Don't mention it about dying. Really? Stop mentioning it. <laughs> okay, so. You can come back later again. Anytime to buy, figure out how to get to Mukuroka. I had to buy that perfume for that lady. Let me see if there's an instruction. Wow, looks like more stuff opened up. Yeah. That's the most rest I guess it's new restaurant, that's a store. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah, there's even more stuff there. Oh, this is not the only place anymore. I can't go even more places. Ooh. Oh I guess. there it is, I have to okay, so. So the, the town's opened up even more so I can get plenty. I'm not just limited to this little block anymore. You hear about this yet? There's a store man in the north part of Rock and I called Ginryu. Mm -hmm. Ginryu? Never heard of him. Apparently, his store plays downright mesmerizing. It's so beautiful. Wow, I'd love to see that sometime. Store man named Ginryu, huh? Maybe I'll try to find him in Rock and I. Ooh, let's see. Oh, this was sick. In the old days, before they had like concrete and asphalt, so it's all gonna be a oh man. Even my eye feels like uh, feels like it's something getting in there from just seeing that stuff. <laughs> yeah, fight. Oh you, you, oh. Huh. Rank up. 
destroying these things. It's a delivery car. Wait. Hey, I can't go any further? Seriously? I guess I gotta take the longer way up, huh? Daisy mm. Paul. Oh. <laughs> There's a foreigner here. Watch yourself, Sensei. Please, I always do. <laughs> no, I'm serious. Foreigners aren't exactly welcome around here right now. Especially not by the Kakume Jui. The who? Kakume Jui. They've been killing pretty much any and uh, all foreigners as of late. They're a group of Sono Jui idealists who essentially see foreigners as pests. If you're not from around here, then you'll likely get a sword or two pointed your way. Eh, well, let them point. I love this country. And I'll give everything I got for my till my last breath. Surely these idealists will understand that. Perhaps they just need someone to explain. <sighs> I don't think you're taking this seriously enough. Your enthusiasm charming though, I'll give you that. Just be careful, alright? Don't go wandering off to dangerous places by yourself. Please. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> so you got a warning. That kid worries me too much. He kinda looks like Mario with <laughs> that bushy and mustache. <laughs> Anyhow, I should put up and get home. Maybe I'll take a shortcut. Hmm. I have a feeling you're gonna get yourself into a big trouble pretty soon. Not even five minutes, he's already ignored the student's advice. Still, I'm worried about this complimentary group myself. Might be a good idea to follow him. Oh. Another sub story to follow. Where did he go? I think he went this way. Mm -hmm. Oh, is that it? Oh no. What the freak is this? You got a problem, guy? Yeah, you. <laughs> I think it's time you learned how to behave in public. Oh, you think you're gonna teach me, huh? Just freaking try. Yeah, I do regret that one. Really sorry about that, man. Where'd that guy go? Yeah, I was actually you know, supposed to go to Mukurogami here. Yeah. So, I'm gonna go there first. Yeah, keep up with Lady Waiting. Or pick up bone. Ah, you there, good samurai. Do you have a moment to spare? What is it? Oh, blacksmith. So I guess this is where I go to uh, get new weapons. Don't do express. Your katana appears to have seen better days. Without proper upkeep, even the finest place will dull in. I imagine a dull sword won't do well for Shinzengumi work, wouldn't it? Daddy. How did you know? <laughs> Nowadays, there are really only two directions a samurai would be headed in Rakunai. There's Gion to the east, or the Shinzengumi to the west. You don't strike me as the Gion type. <laughs> eh, 
You're pretty good. <coughs> if you leave your sword in our hands, we'll be sure to hone it to its true potential. I see. Well, I'll at least hear you out. Great! Now, just this way, please. <laughs> hmm. I've never seen you around before. I heard you can temper swords here. Yeah. Don't be understanding me. Not only can we temper and harden swords, we can do it with the guns and gears too. We forge them all, dude. <coughs> Sounds like you're a bit new around here. I'm only going to explain this once, so listen up. The blacksmith you can craft equipment as well as enhance them. Equipment crafting you can equip. This is like kind of similar to what I did back at um, Yakuza 7, the, the romance workshop. We got all that? Good. By the way, if you ever need a raw materials, you can buy them from that guy over there. Go take a look. Oh, I forgot one more thing. It's important. We don't make enchanted swords of any type. Too risky. We don't want anyone to end up cursed by one of our blades. If you want an enchanted sword, there is someone in Kyo who makes them. But I don't know who. You're on your own if you want that guy. Whole thing make me queasy. There is one thing we do to ward off bad luck though. We'll have you perform the last strike of the hammer. We call it a soul force strike. It's sort of like infusing the equipment with your own soul. But it ain't easy. Even blacksmiths are great at it, so only try at your own risk. But other than the soul force strike, all the work on your stuff will be done by one of our smiths. They're very good. Why? Look at this katana we forged. So sharp. Go ahead. Give it a swish. Obtain handy blade. Repair, obtain spear seal attack. But well, that's all I got to say. Been a pleasure. Crafting and enhancing weapons, huh? I'm sure I'll run into some skilled user while I track down the mask man. I should probably make good use of this place. Okay, once I'm done here, I'll head over to the shins and go be back. So abilities, uh, let's see what it did. Oh, yeah, of course, man, or... Why not again? Been walking. This next one over here. This is a finishing staff. I got a new sword here. Handy blade. Doesn't do much. I got the most powerful blade right here, right now. I guess that these are the slots that you can um, upgrade them. Huh? sell stuff for crafting and enhancing equipment. You can always find commonly used items here, although we don't expect to keep really available stuff in stock. Please take this. It'll help you remember what you were here. Obtain obsidian chunk. Obtain pearl, precious key. Exquisite costume. Bronze hammer. We hope you honor us with your patronage. Thank you. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Base fair, you. Oh, oh, you can actually. No, I don't want to go anywhere yet. Don't have to see you again. Where are you on here? Hmm. Something happening over here? Uh huh? Move along, sir. I'm up to my ears in shenanigans already. Mind if I ask what's going on? Two of these men have perpetrated a heinous act! And what? You don't know which two? Well, see for yourself. They're hiding in a group of five. Group of five. Kyo has a policy of collective responsibility. As I'm sure you know, these convicted of crimes serve their punishments together. These five perpetrators were all assigned to clean the Doshin station house. That's when the abominable incident took place. 
What kind of incident? They my beautiful They ate the beautiful Daifuku mochi I've been saving all morning. <laughs> it's like Seriously? <laughs> Other Doshin were out on patrol, so the only people who had access to our snack room were these five. According to Iron and Stepmom, two of them split it behind the back of the station. I just need to pinpoint these two. So, who are these five men? while performing community service? So, and ate the mochi you were saving for later. Huh. Yes, it makes you sick just to think about it, doesn't it? Attempting to interrogate the group, the mochi mystery, <laughs> but the stories contradict. Looks like the two guilty ones are lying in order to thwart my investigation. Wait, I know. Why don't you talk to them instead? What good would that do? To be completely honest, I'm too upset about Daifuku Mochi to even think straight. I can't perform police work like this. <sighs> guilty ones won't come forward and I'm all out of patience. My only remaining option is capital punishment. All over for a mochi? Jeez, isn't that... <laughs> Talk about petty. But you seem like a smart enough guy. Maybe you can make a more rational decision than I can make. <laughs> Just, uh, I can't believe I got myself into this. Fine, I'll talk to them. Mm, fine. Let me hear what they have to say. <laughs> Great. Okay. Talk to them all and let's see what you can make of their story. All of you, introduce yourself. Starting from the left. I'm Higashihara Nishiyama. <laughs> Why are you so cute? Nakagawa here. Mi Minami no. Itajima, sir. There you have it. All right, all of you, form an orderly line to be questioned by this uh deputy or whatever. <laughs> yes, sir. Let's start from here. Higashira. Higashihara. What can you tell me about the mochi? All I know is that one of the culprits might be Kitajima. I saw him with his hands on the thing. No doubt about it. <coughs> hmm. Uh, according to Ikashiara, one of the guilty pair is Kitajima. <coughs> uh, <this one. coughs> what the hell for instance? Quite a puzzle, isn't it? Or I can think either Nakagawa-san or Minamino-san here, but not both. Nakagawa or Minami? Not both. What do you have to tell me? <coughs> it had to have been Nishiyama with Kimono and Daifuku powder on it. I saw! Hmm. Going to Minami, one of the guilty pairs of Nishiyama. Nishiyama. Let me hear your testimony, Nishiyama. Only Higashiara and Minami had the keys to the snack room. One of them, or both, is who you're after. Hmm. So according to Nishiyama, guilty parent goes Higashihara, Minamino, or both. I didn't talk to this guy. Did I talk to this guy? I could go, I didn't. <coughs> I could go. Mochi filling in his mouth. Also, I was with Nishiyama the whole time, so he's clean. Hmm. So, <laughs> I figured it out. Mm -hmm. yeah. Guess I'll go pick up. Oh, oh, there's actually something there. Price to get her. Okay. 
Pretty hot right now. Hello. Stand the key. Her new man. He is a stand. Stand the key. Her new man. What is this demon? Operator. Nishiyama. Minami. Definitely sure it's these two. Oh. Her new man. These two. Don't stop, Mochi. <laughs> yeah, it's so dramatic. Sorry, but do you think you could review the case just one more time? When you once more? I mean, I'm starting to feel a little embarrassed keeping you all standing. Or be accused next, or just go with them. Can you use that? I think. Okay, let me ask the Nishiyama again. It's Minamino, Gashihara. It's Nishiyama. It's Minamino, it's Gashihara. It's Kitajima. Let's see. Let's see. Mina, Mina, keep that thing. Her new man. Oh my dear. And then just keep that thing. Stand the key. Her new man. Oh my dear. Interesting. Yeah, let's try. Her new man. These two look that mochi. What can I say? You're clever enough to despise her this riddle. Huh? You heard him. He said it was the two of you and that's good enough for me. Let's go. There's law and order to be done. Am I right? Quite disappointed. Another case adequately close. I guess now I did get it right. <laughs> right or wrong, my mochi of justice. Thank you for your help, citizen. Hmm. I wonder if I really did the right thing here. <laughs> well, that was kind of weird. <laughs> Damn. I'm not gonna go there just yet. I'm gonna go to the Moku. What is it called again? <laughs> Moku ga guy or something. <laughs> 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 yeah, I get it. I should really learn really how to. Ah, you. Ah, she's a. How did she get her from behind me? Evil. Worm. Yeah. Oh, there's another one thing to pick up. Hi. Mm. <laughs> 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 Am I going to 
पॉइंट जो आए भाई ओके ओके जाना Oh jeez, seriously. The price ticket. This way. This way. I'll see you later. Is that? that guy looks familiar. Wait, that's... Well, what do you know? Just the man we've been looking for. And he came right to us. We are the Kakumei Jun. If you ain't from around here, you got no choice but to make sure you're dead and gone. So, what kind of logic is that? Huh? Huh? My name is Creek. I come to Japan to share my country's knowledge of agriculture. Frankly, this place is a tap behind. With the help from me, will do wonders for this place, truly. For the sake of this marvelous country and its farmers, I simply cannot die here. So please, hurting me is really hurting you. <laughs> <laughs> Get a load of this guy. Grab it, old man. This country is way better off without scheming little chumps like you. We're just looking to line your pockets by pulling the wool over our eyes, right? Why the hell should we trust a single thing you say? But, but, but really, I have this country's best interest at heart, and... Shut it! Outside your scum! Alright, boys, let's get this over with. Hey, hold on! Hmm? Who are you? <coughs> We're on the street, a bunch of extremists have been going around killing foreigners. Is that you guys? They're like the, the Hyo, the Edo, <laughs> um, they're like the Edo, um, wait, how do you say that word? They're like the Edo version of, um, <laughs> white supremacists, <laughs> you can say. 
What if it is? Then I'll have to stop you. But hey, the outsider's already got his one fool. Traitor, this one dies too. Brooks, yeah. Me is a wild dancer. <laughs> Dangerously. This one's got more speed. <laughs> What's this guy made of? What good is to kill foreigners like this? What good? Easy. We don't need him. We're getting rid of him. That's a pretty big statement. There's a lot to be learned from other cultures, you know. It could help Japan for generations to come. Get real. The only people that are going to help are the Japanese. Plain and simple. Try to get in the way of that, and you'll end up buried along with the old man. We'll hit you with everything we have, and don't you forget it. Yeah, yeah, that's Trump supporters right there. <laughs> the, the, Edo, that's where I, was, where I was looking for it, the equivalent. <laughs> the, the Edo period equivalent of Trump supporters. <laughs> uh. Sure, you alright? Yes, thanks to you. Please. Call me Greek. I teach agriculture nearby. I'm sorry though. I'm sorry for my fellow countryman's behavior. I hope this won't change your mind about rest of us. <laughs> Nonsense. You're Japanese after all. And you stuck your neck out for me. No question asked. I don't really understand the hate for those from overseas. But I'm sure they'll understand me once they see how much I care. I truly believe that. The fact of the matter is, they want to do what's best for Japan do. You might be right. Still, it's kind of sad that people who believe in the same thing can't believe in one another. Yes, I would just love for men like them to see eye to eye with men like me one day. In fact, nothing would please me more. Well, it's a noble thought. You should put yourself- you shouldn't put yourself in danger like that. I try to avoid being reckless from now on. If you see those guys again, Run. Not everyone's willing to hear you out. Of course. Thank to you, Don Saito-san. Nice to know there are people like you out there too. Oh well. <laughs> Here's hoping Crete keeps himself out of trouble. Oh, it's feeling I guess I'm gonna be seeing him again soon. I'm not done with him completely. This is the bomb, isn't it? How do I get in? <laughs> oh. 
Tô aí. It's virtue. Hmm. Can you eat that? Oop. Yeah, but how am I supposed to get there? Oh, maybe this way? Maybe it's not available yet. Uh, maybe a taxi to you. <coughs> there it is. So I have to uh, actually to take uh, some kind of if in front of the Komaki to go down it there. Uh, I just came all this way for nothing. Uh. Well, I mean, not a total loss. I just keep going on here now. Ijanaka! Ijanaka! So, there again. Ijanaka! Ijanaka! That song. Ijanaka. It was around here. <laughs> I did this before. <laughs> Back at the other like, area. Ijanaka! Ijanaka! Oh, sorry, time is okay. At it again, hmm? <laughs> Are you alright now? Oh, I'll be fine. The dancer just bumped into me. Uh oh. What total lack of consideration. They can't just eat and knock their way out of this. Boy. Hey, all of you. Huh? Eh? What do you want? You need to be careful about where you're dancing. One of you knocked down an old woman. <sighs> Why are you being a wet blanket, man? We're trying to eat Janaka out here. This guy obviously has no interest in protesting. He's only doing it because it's fashion. What kind of movement has this become? Hey, clear the street if you're not gonna dance. You're either Ijanaka or Ijanaina. Gee, <laughs> is that all you're here for? Oi. Dancing? Tell the truth, I was hoping to kick the sheep out of somebody like you. Uh, <laughs> that's how we do it. Okay. I do. I forgot I cannot block. Look, oh, this guy has a gun. Ah. 
high, will you? They're just getting stronger and stronger. Oh, beautiful. Oh, that's how you want to play, huh? Throw him into the river. <laughs> hey, had enough, Ejen that guy? <sighs> you gotta be Ejen like kidding me. <laughs> nice pun there. Are you done? Yeah, here. Take this and we'll go. Yeah, obtain vermilion fabric. Look for everything. Oh, well, at least they're pretty nice about it. That was kind of you, Samurai. Thank you. Yeah. Don't mention it. This each and I got thing has really gotten out of hand. Eh. Perhaps. But I understand them, in a way. I've never seen times like these before. Everyone is out of their minds with worry, for themselves, for the country. But maybe with samurai like you around, there's a bit of hope for us. <laughs> you give me too much credit. He's right. With the whole nation in turmoil, only natural people would start acting out strangely. Maybe it's unfair for me to reject everything about each and that guy. <laughs> okay. Is the sub story complete? Well, I guess I better head back to the, uh, the Teradaya area where it's at. Hmm. Oh, this place is like a maze. Wait. Ah. Dear dear, huh? Things are just getting fun here. Come back later. I'll take you all on. <clears throat> I'll take you all on if you're so bored that you stoop to this kind of thing. You say what? Well, find it. <clears throat> we'll F you up real good. Yeah, I promise. Well, lady, hi. Oh, oh, keep running to so much uh, <laughs> incidents. Hey, what are you doing, man? Careful. What's going on over there? This looks like could be not. Oh, something with guns. We gotta get a move on. Hey, what do you think you're looking at? Oh, dang it! We're busted! Hmm? What the hell are these guys doing? Screw it! We got no choice they've been made! This has to stay under wraps! I'm not here to arrest you or anything. This isn't my concern, just let me pass. Not happening, a-hole. We're under strict orders from the boss. Oi! Nah, what in Sam Hill is going on here? Nah, <laughs> who's this another? Foreign dude. But like um But boss? This guy saw the hard work, but don't worry, we're about to kill him. Screw it up, forgive me, boss. Ah Easy now. Everybody mistakes. What matters is how you handle yourself once it happens. You follow? <laughs> like a cowboy dude then. Now I did say to keep this here operation on the down low. That means taking a missteps in stride, being discreet. Right, I yeah, of course, boss. Sorry. So hmm. Reckon it ain't no difference, either way. You boys carry the goods back to the hideout. I'll have a chat with my new friend here. Right away, boss. I can't have you just mosey on from this little encounter, boy. 
So, what do you plan to do about it? <laughs> <laughs> no need for hostilities. If I were planning to draw on you, you'd know it. Truth is, I am a merchant. One who fancies himself able to fashion a fair deal for all parties. You want to make a deal? My crew and I got ourselves a little hole in the wall around here. You'd be so kind as to follow me. Hmm. A merchant who's stockpiling that many firearms? He'd be an inconvenient enemy. Alright. Let's talk. Okay. <coughs> what mess have I gotten myself into? What's all this? Ah. Welcome to my place of business. Well, wow. like a weapon shop, I guess. Not just a um, the mm -hmm. that blacksmith place that would offer the weapon. Allow me to introduce myself. I go find Mr. William Bradley. What shall I call you? I'm not so sure I want to give you my name. <laughs> Negotiations are built upon trust, boy. Keep your lips sealed, if you like. I assure you, I've got ways of digging up dirty truths. Saito Hajime. Good. First name Hajime? Oi. Good. Add it to the list, would ya? On it, boss! Glad you to make your acquaintance, Hajime. You know the phrase, brass tacks? Here's where they get down to them. What I need from you is to forget what you done saw on that street corner today. Now, Normally, I estimate the price of a man's silence in terms of coin. Something tells me, though, you might find this a little more persuasive. Mm -hmm. What? A gun? <laughs> a top-of-the-line piece. Nobody else is packing heater like that in the land of the rising. I understand. You're not trying to bribe me. You're trying to incriminate. If you paid me, it could, I could still turn you in. With this in my possession, though, I would have to answer for it. Yes. You are damn sharp, Hajime. If you're quick, if you're that quick on the uptake, this won't take long. I wasn't going to tell anyone in the first place. I don't need this, I got my own gun. Eh? A man who's already armed and dangerous? You know, I think you and I might be fast friends. I don't think we'll be friends at all. If it's, if that's everything you have to say, I'll be going. <sighs> have it your way then. Boss. What have you got? Oh, ho, oh, is that right? What is this? Begging your pardon, we seem to might have another matter to discuss before I see you on your way. What do you want now? Yes. Your Saito Hajime, a guest of Teradaya over in Fushimi. If rumors to be believed, you're a veritable devil with that sword. And to top it all up, you're with the Shinzen uh. group. Now, ain't that interesting as all get out. So, while you kept me busy, your men went looking for informa information on me. Yeah. Standard procedure. I like to call it the merchant set salutation. That said, there are some things beyond even the eyes and ears of my boys. You ever heard of the Urama Urayama Company? Urayama Company. <laughs> no. I figured as much. That's the handle of the den of thieves, what killed the man who was like a brother to me. There's but one reason I planted my roots in this territory. Revenge on every last one of them sons of biatches. My brother was Japanese, but he never treated me like no outsider. Love that man. And I was there the day the company came, in cold blood, shot him down. Mr. Saito Hajime of the Shinsenkumi. I reckon you cross paths with them loyal shishi on the regular, don't you? Please, if you ever hear even the whisper of a whisper about the Urayama company, I need you to bring it to me. I ain't asking for free. I got money, weapons, anything you want. It's yours. Save it. I've also seen someone who looks like family to me murdered before my eyes. I understand how you feel. But I'm not a mercenary. I don't take payments to help black market dealers avenge their dead. Surely, there must be some way for us to come to an agreement. Please, sir, on our boss's behalf, we're begging you to help him. He's a good man, really. He provided us with food and shelter and pays us generously. Knock it off, boys. I know we've got no right to ask you, 
but you're the best chance he has, Saito-san. All we can do is beg and bow our heads. Please. Calm down, both of you. I'll see what I can do, alright? Don't expect much. I've got a lot going on and I've never heard of these guys before. If that changes, I'll let you know. Hajime. Thank you! Thank you so much, Saito-san! Hey, boss! If Saito-san's getting in with us, why don't you teach him some of your techniques? <laughs> now, there's an idea. Hajime, you might carry a piece. Uh, how well you can you use the thing? Oh uh, well, I don't know. I mostly just point and shoot. No. No, no, no! I can't have you firing off like some hillbilly with a pea shooter. You have to work or art. I give all my boys armament. It's the know-how that really lets them protect themselves. So, what? You also give them target practice? Yes. Haha, -ha, what good is knowing how to shoot a bottle or a stuff dummy? No, I like to keep things practical here. Hey, why don't we all welcome Saito-san to the gang by taking him on? Ah. Not a bad idea. Load your chamber, Hajime. I'll give you some pointers as you take him on. You're going to teach me better gun techniques? Fine, I'll go along with this. Okay, y'all ready? Raw! Oh, so I guess now he's gonna be teaching me gun skills, huh? This is all just the gun only. Hold and release or keep the mark and fire at a wide range of enemies. That's all I can do, huh? Great! Starting to see how there's more to a derringer than pointing and shooting? Yeah, actually. Firearms might even have as much depth to them as swordsmanship does. Haha! <laughs> now, that's what I like to hear, Hajime. And this is only the beginning. Hmm. I'll come back. We'll help you however we can too. Please, just try to find information for the boss. Alright. I'll let you know if I come across anything. My thanks. Feel free to come and go from this place as you please from now on. Uh. Oh, and one other thing. A lot of goods pass through our fingers down here. My boys are fledgling traders in their own right. Might score yourself a deal. Talk to them if you're interested in a bit of bartering. Or if you're just in the mood to shoot the breeze. Got it. I'll keep that in mind. Good. See you down the road, Hajime. Okay, so this is where I learned to I guess, practice my um, gun abilities. So like a wild dancer or in training. Oh. I got four right now, so we do some more with this uh all is your dodachi. Got the sword play grip. <laughs> this one. Worst combo tempest. Right before you charge. Yeah. Oh, should the dodge you quit XYB? Well, wow. we have to have the Odachi, huh? Or play swap. What's the Odachi? Well, let me hold on to that. One.
I got some new gun. Oh no. You didn't give me any. Okay, well. Okay. I need to. Maybe. maybe. Okay, this is where I go to. Are you psyched, RG man? Well, you told me all you got goods to exchange down here. That's right. We got lots of useful stuff. Thing is, we only work in barter and trade. Your money is no good to us. Ask around if you're interested. Everyone's got something different, I'm pretty sure. Here's what I can offer you. Book of Revelations, Gus. I'll trade for you for five cards worth of bear. Good deal, right? Only because you're a friend of the boss. Deal with that later. Five wooden bear. How do I exit out of here? Um, how do I get out of here? It seems like the only exit, but... Oh, yeah. Leave. There you go. I have to take the stairs. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I guess that's where I go to get my gun training. So keep that in mind. I really want to get back to that. Get back to the Terra Dyer. Or price to okay. Oh, another one here. Oh, there's so much to explore. It's yeah. so slow picking that up, man. Okay, is this the exit? Oh, okay. Thank you. Get me out of here. Get back to the... Ah, come on. Good seasoning. Get some speed too. Not me, but oh. yeah. <laughs> I am struggling. Oh, look at me. Yeah, I better just eat something, I guess, huh? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Well, you've got 
Good friend, thank you so very much. Yeah, I got all these tickets uh, to waste, so I'm about to play with it. What? Seriously? Oh, come on. So did you just get give me all the green ones? Oh my gosh. <laughs> they just gave me all the green ones. Oh gosh. Let me try to spin this one. Oh god. <laughs> oh come on. Yeah, <laughs> just give me all green ones. Finally! I got something different. First prize! Well done! Silver hammer! Thank you. Okay, anyway. Oh, I got all these papers like cluttering. I mean, this is like the equivalent of the pocket tissues. By the Komaki Studio. Is that the guy who No, that's a courier. Isn't that? That's the courier I give directions. Is she lost again? Ugh, I can't believe I'm lost again. Hey, what's going on? Oh, you're that kind samurai from before. Were you able to find Fushimi Ichibangi? No. No matter how far I walk, I go in circles and end up back here. How is that possible? Hold me right around the corner. The truth is, I've always been absolutely hopeless with directions. Why did you become a career then? Then I've always worked with my father. He helped me out, but the other day he collapsed. And now you're on your own. Yes. And to keep him from worrying while he recovers, I need to prove that I can do this myself. It's embarrassing having to rely on it all this time. 
<laughs> I can understand that. Sounds like this might be a good chance for you to stand on your own two feet. Exactly. I'm sorry, but could you tell me one more time? Way to Fushimi Ichibanga? Yeah. First, head straight from here to Paradise. Once you pass that, look to your right for a large shopping district. Mm. Sounds simple enough. I think I can do it this time. Thank you. Good luck. Really not that hard, then, pal. Mm. For you, it's terrible directions. Good that he's not giving up, I suppose. I hope you'll be alright. Oh, I think I see that guy there now. Oh, finally. Why have I only been here before? And the Mokuro guy boss, I'll get you another 500 more. Let's go. The lady's waiting for her perfume. Let's embark on our voyage. Okay. Let's find this perfume. Oh, where for them? I might be. <laughs> the bad side of town. Uh, uh, what are you wearing? Good old guy. This thing creeps every time I come here. Hmm? Yup. <laughs> ah! Hell is wrong with you people? Really gotta help. You're a Mukuro guy, Dama. You do this day in, day out. <laughs> <laughs> you heard him. Turn over your cap, or we'll leave you rotting in the street. Hey, hey, hey. Money. We're gonna get money. Sorry. All you get from me is a cold taste of steel. Huh? What was that? You think we're afraid of you? We we'll just take the money off your corpse. Make no difference to me. Get him! Ruffians. Oh, jeez. He just did that. It's this guy! Screw him! Let's go find easier prey! Go on, dang it! Let's go! When did they call this place a dead man's quarter? There's a guard down here. Hmm? Need to find him. Hmm. He's not with you. Where would I find that? Arm healer? Your thing. Take a look. It's for sale. Pencil cutter. Yeah, that's what they'll dodge you. The mystic revolver. Window shopping? Yeah, you're all what I need. Looking for the perfume. Hey, where would I find the perfume? Please, sir. We just spare something to eat. Oh god. No end to it if I hope in though. Please wait. I haven't eaten anything all week. 
I'll take whatever you can give, so please. Oh, weak. At this rate, he'll starve to death. I can't just leave him. I can probably some food. Give me some Ohagi then. Here, eat this. Oh, thank you! Yum, 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 yum. Hi, this is delicious. Thank you so much. You, sir, are a god among men. Truly. A god, huh? You're a slick one, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> Please, I'm but a lowly beggar. Cut me some slack. Still, it's been a long time since I've eaten, much less felt any kindness from anyone. I honestly feel blessed. I'll be sure to repay you one day. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe worry about how you're gonna eat first and save pay paying me back for later. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, boss, thanks again. Another bond with the servile beggar. <laughs> need to find this one. Where can I find this one? <laughs> Cannon? <laughs> if I get us mad about it. <laughs> then maybe later. It defines a perfume. This. Again. It's that Greek? What's he doing here by himself? He gets attacked again. The same like you. Maybe that's him? That must be the merchant who sells scented water. Okay, that must be it. Boy. Hey! I'd like to talk to you. <laughs> oh, you found me! But you'll never catch me! I think you're mistaking me for someone else. I'm looking to buy something off you. <gasps> the hell you are! Not if I kill you first! Oh, yeah. Trouble some man. How do I kill you? <laughs> Kill you, man. I just wanna uh, buy that stupid perfume. <sighs> Dang it. I'm really up Sheep Creek this time. You got me dead to rights. Calm down. I'm only here to make a purchase. You're not under arrest. Mm -hmm. Oh? 
You're actually buying? Uh. That's right. Oh, sorry about that. You just showed up out of nowhere with a face like an ogre's and my alarm bells went off. Well, I normally don't trade with strangers, but to apologize for making you kick my A, I'll open up shop. I see. Thanks. <laughs> what can I do for you, mister? Okay. I've heard of a certain scent of water that makes it wear irresistible to men. Do you carry that? Um, yeah, I got it. That's what you want? Hmm. It's all kinds, I guess. It's for someone else. Yeah, alright. Whatever you say. <laughs> I getting some weird strange ideas over here. There you go. It's called perfume. It's supposed to drive men crazy. Somehow. How much is it? <laughs> Tell you what. Just to put the whole thing behind us, it's yours for free. Honestly, I don't even know how well it works. Don't? It was hard to believe that some little bottle of water will make you attractive to men. You can try it out first if you're skeptical. Here, have a waft. <laughs> oh, there is an aroma to it. Sensual? Still, nothing like a love potion, to be sure. Those are what I get it for, Dunda. Thanks. Suspicious. Mm -hmm. Something wrong? Hey! You... What? Me? I love you. <laughs> eh? I love you! <laughs> oh no! What the hell? <laughs> I love you! I love you! I love you! I'll go to the ends of the earth for you, Mr. Sir! Lover! This from that perfume? Yeah, it really does work. <laughs> you see how I'm looking torn with this stuff. Let me see. Hey, why don't we go somewhere quiet? Just you and me. His face is flushed. I can practically hear his heart beating. Oh, God. Love you, mister. Let's do this. It's gone berserk. I can't just find him again while he's like this. I have to get out of here. Thanks for the water! <laughs> that was really awful. Oh, screw the water! No way! Screw me! <laughs> yeah, that way, like, oh, so really? Oh, I have to run! I guess I gotta get away from this guy. Where do I go? I need to get out of here. Let me! Leave me alone! Ah! I guess I need to find a place to hide somehow. He's too close to me. Ah! No! I'm going around in circles! Okay, I think I lost him. Yeah, I managed to shake him off. Oh! <laughs> that got really awkward. <laughs> oh, wait, no. How did I get here? Oh, I guess I have to. I guess I need to Let's find my way back to that lady. Gosh, gotta take a long way all over again. Oh. What is this? Weird over here. It's kind of creepy. It's just standing there like some like zombie. <laughs> This guy is a real a, a psycho. Okay. 
Sit down. Let's see. Let's this far out? I should be safe here. What's this? Oh. <laughs> oh, well, anyway. I did manage to find that lady. Get back to the lady. Phew. Yeah. Managed to get away. Oh, sir. How did it go in Makoto Guy? Were you able to buy that perfume? Uh. Um, yeah. I have it here. We handed over the perfume. <laughs> I can hardly believe it. Thank you. This is the start of a whole new life where men will actually look my way. They'll do more than just look, so be careful. You might end up attracting more than what you bargained for. Eh? Eh? Um, sure. So this is what perfume is capable of. Things could go very bad quickly if word of it tried to. What a horrifying invention. <laughs> Okay, well, okay, I got done with that. I think I'll go ahead and um, stop here. Huh? There's still, still like several more like side, side story that I gotta uh, take on. Like I gotta meet that creek dude again and uh, I have to go back to do some training with Komaki and then the uh, cowboy will. So. And safe here. Whoa, I really went far, huh? I guess it's the, my, the one that these are all the auto save. Oh, there's sure a lot of auto save. <laughs> yeah, <coughs> this, is where, this is where I'll stop. So. And I, uh, yeah, well, I won't be able to, um, I won't be. Um, online tomorrow because I, I gotta um, go home, actually go home back down to my parents on the other side of this town. Like over the weekend, uh, something came up, so I won't be able to stream the Tall Gamer. But I think I'll, um, I'll be back on Sunday and, and I think I will go ahead and start um, playing, um, streaming uh, Tall Gamer for Sundays too. So I'll, maybe I'll make a note of that. Oh, by the way, it comes to you. I didn't even give her back the money she had. She paid me to buy that perfume. I even got it for free. <laughs> but then, you know, again, like, what what I just went through, that nightmare had just barely, like, dodged that, you know, <laughs> that creepy stalker. I think it's, um, I, I think I can, um, yeah, go ahead and keep it. You know, that's, it is uh, worth the, all the trouble that uh, I had to go through for. So, yeah, there's like a little compensation there. <laughs> what I do. Okay, well, you guys have a good night, and I guess I'll see you back on Sunday. Thank you for watching. Yeah. So long, everybody. Stay safe.